Scorpio, this is Tracy from Northeast Tarot and welcome to your weekly tarot forecast for the week of June 19th through June 25th. This is for Leo Sun, Leo Moon, and Leo Rising Signs. So Leo, I am using the Tarot of the Mermaids deck along with the Magical Mermaids and Dolphins Oracle cards by Dorian Virtue. I will have the decks that I'm using uh, listed below in the description bar. Alright, Leo, so at the bottom of the deck I do have the Eight of Wands. Alright, it's very interesting spread, Leo. So with the Eight of Wands, communication could be very significant this week. A lot of text messages, a lot of emails going back and forth. Let's see. Um, for some of you, you know, you might have a lot going on here with the Eight of Wands and then the overall energy being the Ten of Wands. Some Leos are, are definitely spread a little bit too thin this week. So needing to take caution with this energy. I think that some Leos, you have a lot going on. You have a lot on your plate. So needing to lighten your load or maybe needing to ask for help um, for some of you. With the Ten of Wands, this can be a burdensome, stressful sort of energy. So I think that some of you simply just have a lot going on. So it is maybe taking a toll on you physically. You might feel uh, a little exhausted or tired. So make sure that you're maybe taking some you time this week, Leo. Uh, now I did pull an additional clarifying card and we do have the Two of Swords. So a decision might be very significant this week. So some of you maybe need to make a decision, to be honest. Uh, this could be a person who's a little closed off and someone's definitely not open. So if you're a business owner or if you're working two jobs, whatever it is, you might have a lot on your plate. Maybe you're a single parent, you work full time. You know, this can be a person who doesn't want to lighten their load, someone who's not open to change. So I think that some of you are feeling definitely weighed down and a little stressed out this week um, and, and I think you need to be open for some of you with the two of swords here it's almost like you're not open you don't want to change or you don't want to lighten your load um, so again you know just take caution with that for some other Leos uh, the two of swords can represent a decision there could be a decision or a partnership of some kind that's very significant there could be stress um, in regards to this so maybe some of you are waiting on a decision could be a decision from your partner and then maybe some other Leos actually need to make a decision um, with the world here it could be in regards to travel absolutely but also you know this might be in regards to something completing so something coming full circle in your life maybe some of you are in this process um, I always say with the world you know it is a very long chapter within your life that's completing um, but you are easing out of one chapter easing into the next chapter so patience is required this isn't something that's going to happen overnight so for some of you this is you know process that you're going through right now and you know some of you it might be a little little bit of a stressful period make sure that you're getting enough sleep with a nine of swords here for some of you you could be worrying unnecessarily or overthinking things um, but then for some other Leo's this is you definitely needing um, some you time this week make make sure you're getting enough sleep getting enough rest uh, for some of you, I definitely see you see you making time with the hermit here. You are going to go off. You are going to spend some time alone. You are going to catch up on your sleep. But for those Leos that are going off and taking that you time, just try to remain positive. Um, if you are thinking about certain things, you know, don't allow your mind to drift off into that negative place. This can be someone who's dealing with some anxiety or someone who's really worrying about something, stressing about something, overthinking it most of the time. Um, so just take caution with that. For those of you that need to make a decision, um, you know, going off, spending some time alone, listening to your intuition. For other Leos, maybe going off and talking to someone, an attorney, a father, a grandfather, someone that you trust. Uh, could definitely be giving you advice um, for some of you with the six of pentacles and the hermit here you could be receiving um, you know some sort of guidance some sort of advice from someone 
with the Six of Pentacles, you also could be receiving some sort of generosity. Someone could be helping you. This could be a father, a grandfather, someone who's helping you out financially as well. Because some of you definitely could be in a maybe a difficult spot here with the devil. There could be some Leos that maybe you feel stuck or you feel trapped. Also, you know, this can be a lot of fear. So again, needing to take caution with that, needing to remain positive. Uh, but for some of you, it's almost like you're, you're maybe stuck in a difficult situation or environment. Something that's no longer serving you with the devil and needing to move forward. But some of you, you know, you're, you're going to seek that advice or you're going to you know go within make a decision for some of you that's what you're doing this week you're you're maybe receiving that advice or maybe even that generosity that can help you in some way uh, leave this behind with the devil it's something that's no longer serving you You know, what's interesting is we have this devil and across I have the five of cups. And the five of cups can sometimes represent regrets. And the devil can be uh, something that was tempting. So there could be some Leos that you might have had like a tempting offer. Some sort of temptation on the table. And for some of you, you know, you might have experienced this energy um, because, you know, all of you Leos will experience this energy at different times. So maybe some of you have already had some, some sort of temptation on the table and maybe you're experiencing some sort of regrets when it comes to that. Now, if you're a Leo that has this on the table this week, if there is something that's tempting you this week, you know, my advice to you would be not not to go for it, not to do it. Um, and that really could be, you know, on any front, this could be money matters, this could be something romantic. Um, with the devil, you know, it can be any sort of temptation, sex, drugs, rock and roll. I mean, it can be just about anything. So it might have something to do with an Aquarius because I have the star on top of the devil and the star represents the sign of Aquarius. So it might have something to do with an Aquarius. Might have something to do with a Capricorn or a Virgo, um, but I'm not getting that too strong here. But there could be something on the table, some sort of tempting offer, some sort of temptation that's in front of you. And my advice to you would be not to not to go for it. Um, but some of you might actually be seeking advice from maybe a family member or someone around you. Uh, and they might tell you the same exact thing. Um, so again, if you need to make a decision, Leo, definitely listen to your intuition here. We, we do have the high priestess here as well. So really needing to listen to your intuition. If you uh, need to make a decision or you have this temptation in front of you, really, really needing to listen to your intuition. And don't allow fears to get the best of you. All things in moderation this week, definitely, Leo. You do have a lot of spiritual divine energy around you. I, I definitely, you know, I definitely feel like your angels, your guides, they're definitely connecting with you. For some of you, uh, you could be receiving a lot of messages this week from spirit. So really take that, take that you time, Leo. Take that time to yourself. Meditate if you like to meditate. Um, because I definitely see some of you receiving a lot of messages here. Now, if you've already dealt with a difficult situation or environment or you're in the process of getting out of a difficult relationship or environment, um, you're definitely being spiritually guided here with the star. This is confirmation you're on the right path. 
So if you are choosing to move forward, even though it's it's a heavy load and it's not the easiest for some of you, you could be moving forward and you know ending a relationship that's no longer serving you. You could be seeking some sort of help if you've had like an addiction of some kind. Whatever it is, you're on the right path. You're 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 moving in the right direction. This is a lot of healing energy, a lot of spiritual energy. So just listen to your intuition, remain positive, and do what you feel is right, Leo. Let me pull you an additional guidance card. Additional guidance for Leo for this upcoming week. Additional guidance for Leo. What does Leo need to know? Interesting. Simplify your life. Eliminate clutter from your home and work life to balance the flow of activities. So needing to get balanced, needing to eliminate any sort of clutter, you know, in your work environment, in your home. But simplify, simplifying your life is important here. Um, with the devil, you know, it can represent things in excess, doing something in excess, overindulging, um, but spirit is really focusing on simplifying your life and all things in moderation, okay, Leo? So I do hope that you found this reading helpful. If you are not subscribed to my channel, please do subscribe. And if you are interested in receiving a private reading from me, please head on over to northeasttower.com. And I do wish you a wonderful week, Leo. Take care.